All right, so uh, I'm over in this park, right? It's uh, Sumida Koen. It's on the Sumidagawa side of the Sumidagawa, <laughs> and it's kind of near where we live. And um, just to show you, like, it's a nice little Japanese park. You can see the sky tree up there in the background. Like, it's like a pleasant little place, right? And there's like usually a bunch of there's like an open area over there, and like there's a bunch of kids like that are doing exercises and stuff with their preschools and some older people doing some exercises and stuff and big crane just came over here and landed and a few minutes ago just across here there were some people taking pictures in their kimono like it's a nice pleasant place i'm just sitting over here reading some japanese minding my own business and uh when i had walked into this little area on this side of the pond it's not like where the normal path is but it's not like restricted you can come in over here there was a dude that was kind of up here in the hill and um like like that dude i don't know <laughs> it's not the same guy and he had like his jacket was kind of opened a little bit and he had this black band around his chest that was like over his nipples and he had it kind of open a little bit and he was just like stretching a little line. i just noticed him and i was like okay that's strange just you know old dude doing weird stuff type thing whatever and um <laughs> i just ignored him came over here sat down like i said enjoyed the view watched some cranes watched people in kimono study my Japanese whatever and then I look back up there and this old man that was there not the one that's there now but the old man with the band around him he's got another dude with him and the dude with the bands on his nipples is facing the guy and he's mostly clothed and the dude is like tweaking his nipples and the dude getting the nipples tweaked has got his dick out and he is just going to town like this dude is given the beans man and I don't have evidence I haven't gone up there and looked for it but I'm pretty sure by his mannerisms he's finished and the most exciting part of the entire thing is I made a video <laughs> so I've got a video of all this as proof and it is uh you know like I <laughs> I don't even know man like I've been here for 10 years and that's the first time I've ever seen a dude getting his nipples tweaked jerking off in the park you can't say that that is something that happens often but maybe I'm just not in the right neighborhood usually but now there's another dude over there like lurking around and it makes me wonder if it's like a meetup place like for dudes to get their nipples tweaked and then they do their business in public while families are out doing things etc I don't know man what is going on? So I walked up to where these old guys is. And there is just like these three dudes sitting here. They would have been in clean sight of the whole situation. So, <laughs> must be a club. <laughs> Get some class, y'all. Just to give more like perspective, like they were up there, right there, like standing up there. And if you go over here like this, this is where all the families and stuff are. Just to be totally clear, I'm not trying to like kink shame anybody, but like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like maybe not where all the kitties can see, you know what I'm saying? Like maybe do that at home or whatever. I don't know, man, but I know that uh, I'm not gonna be walking on that side of the pond anymore. And if for some reason I do walk on that side of the pond, I am going to make sure to be careful of where I step because that's nasty, y'all. 